to think I filmed a old video and then I realized that I did not press record. And now I have to pretend as if I did not even, uh, like I've not even said anything at all. Huh. The Lord is my strength. <laughs> Hi guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome and if you're returning welcome and thank you my name is amina i feel about beauty lifestyle vlogs fashion and all the sweet and interesting stuff so today's video is basically going to be a story time about how my mom forgot me in her shop and went home i know it sounds crazy but it's about to get interesting so if you want to know more about this story then you have to keep on watching so guys i need to make some things clear so you guys would understand the story better so mommy sells food and she closes very late at night i think she closes around 11 p.m 12 a.m i know it is very late yeah but I, I feel like the reason is because most people that she sells to are people that are coming back from work late at night so they can easily get something to eat you understand so that that is like basically the people she sells for so there's this woman beside naomi's shop that sells plastic and all i'm talking about years back now i think i was four four or five years old then so this woman sells plastic and also there's this big table she uses in displaying at her stores like a plastic a kettle a jug and all of those stuff so whenever this woman closes and I'll, i'm about to sleep you know as a very small girl you can't be up late at that time so whenever i'm about to sleep now will just lay me on that table for me to sleep so on this like this that, that day is not like the first that, that is not like the first time i'm sleeping on that table so on this fateful day i told my mommy i wanted to sleep i know some people will be like ah, why do you know all the details like this hello it's because i asked my mom like i asked her every little detail so i can give you guys the full gist though i knew i knew a little bit about the story before but then i had to like know everything so i can give you guys out out <laughs> So on this faithful day, I act. I told her I wanted to sleep. So she put me on the table. It is not the like it is not the first time, she, and it is nothing new. So I was on the table sleeping. So I, I don't know if they were too tired. I don't know what happened. I mean, my mom and her apprentice. They took everything except me. They forgot me on the table and they went home. So let me make some things clear. My mom rented an apartment for her apprentice, and that same house she also lives there with my dad. You understand? So they ha I and my dad have their own separate room. And then she like this another separate room for our princess. So when she when they got home, she said she she went to our room. They went to their room. So getting inside, my dad was like, "Where is Aminat?" And then she was like, "What do I share?" That means she's with the princess. He gets that's if you don't understand your back. So when she, so she, my dad was like, "Okay," because it was it was nothing new. I sometimes sleep there, like she said. So my, she said she was about sleeping and then something in her told her that oh, how about you just go and check you get so she went there to check on getting there she was like i'm in order like which means where is i mean you're yeah, like ah. but she's with you oh well what, what do you know me which means but she's with you and then she was like no i thought she was with you guys <laughs> that was how they were looking at yourself they were just like agbagba me not see you which basically means forgot his Amina at the nation. She said they had to take food because my daddy was not here. <laughs> you know how fathers can be. My own daughter, my only daughter. He said they had to just sit through and then leave the house because my daddy was not here. And it was already late. Everywhere was silent. So immediately they go outside. They <laughs> you need to see the race. They, like they had to run. On getting them here, I was still sleeping. And I'm actually very glad that I was still sleeping because I believe if I had woken up. I would have stood up and then start crying because everywhere would be dark, obviously. It was already very late and then I would be crying. Somebody might just come and carry me like that and then... <laughs> you understand? So I was getting there, I was still sleeping and then they had to carry me and carry me back home. So they had to just tiptoe and just go back inside because <laughs> my daddy was not here, like I said. That man, he does not even play with me. Ever since then, she said she's always very conscious they are always it's just as if there is this bucket list and then they're always ticking shatik bam you know when like have you carried amina yes because it must not happen the second time so with this i guess we've come to the end of the video hit that subscribe button like comment share and also turn on your post notifications to always get notified whenever i post a video 
you know you are viewing this video and you have not subscribed what are you waiting for just subscribe i know i put a smile on your face today how about you just appreciate it and just click that subscribe button also drop a comment i love you bye guys so i need to is yes.